can see him on this jet looking to try and take some heads for now fbx are taking a lot of pressure in towards this b site but g2 haven't pushed past the choke point they've really fought for this opening bit of control but curious that they're slowing down afterwards just waiting for the repeats i suppose ah, and that hasn't gone their way to start with but a good recovery by evolva and oh even my more God. by hoodie and now we get into the the same sort of after palm which we've witnessed for a while angel gonna try and counter a little bit but that shogunar is not landed anywhere near the plant maybe hoping to catch someone a little bit further back but he will be denied now the screen is already down on the other side of the map for the defense so getting back into this is actually going to be relatively difficult angel trying to clear some of those close angles but everyone's fallen back Oh, nice shot by Angel, though. He'll take down Hoodie easily with the second bullet. Although not so easy to deal with a Vova down eventually, but the corner not checked. Nuke you snook away. Hey, we're doing the same thing, guys. We're looking to go go towards B. We're putting our util down, but I think they actually saw Nuke you. I think the knife caught him. I heard the little ding, and they knew that he had to cross back. They've caught him. And so the plan of G2, the, the wide net that they cast out, well, it's caught nothing. Yeah, and this push onto the B site has failed miserably as well. Like, Saigetsu managing to get a couple of kills here is huge. And, and Batty has already found Hoodie, who is completely trapped within the site. It, it, it was a round. Really tough. I, I mean, they probably have to push into them, right? To take this control is, is so difficult. Find any sort of angle where a plant is going to be safe. The spams are coming through. Nuki is not afraid, though. He's stepping up close. He knows that player shortly going to be out of ammunition. And there it is. Now's his time to strike. But Zipan catches him. Evolva as well. And Meadow and Mixwell have to clutch it. A disadvantage stacked against them. They've got no flank ability here. They've got to just take the fights. And the information is there to play with as well. FBX know exactly where these players are or where this player is now, with Meadow being the last alive in the defuse. So far, though, no one's given him the opportunity. No one's taken those peaks. Turtle play on site. Zipan goes down right away. Xiao in trouble. Just two HP. He's going to try his best, but man, he's caught on top of that wall as well. <laughs> really makes things difficult. For FPX, you know, you've lost a lot of players here. Unless you're able to catch a pick quickly, you might consider saving. But Angel going down while well, Sagetsu has a really tough choice to make. Yeah, he's going to try and give this one a go. Has some extra credits to play with, but Zipan's here. The same could be said the other way around, though. He's managed to get so much control, but Baddy is going to check for it. Zipan now makes his swing and gives them a two-man advantage. Really nicely played, Xiao. Unable to land the shot with the operator, but it might not matter. Still through to take down for Hoodie even after that kill and a flank underway. To pop out that blade storm, he says, you know what, Mixwell, you use your old fine. He's going to do the same. Evolva, what a flash. He's blinded up like crazy. Still alive. Gets the reload off, but then Sagetsu takes him down. That spike needs to be defused, and they've got the cover to do it. Mixwell has to dash on in. The steps are enough to pull them off, and for now, he's already taken oh! one. And another landed. That is the round in favor for G2. The Viper wall, at least, and now here comes the Sage on the left side. You'd imagine Viper's pit quite deep, actually, to get them a fair bit of control. A good kill on the zip, and I mean, this is fantastic for the attack to play with. I'm curious if they'll actually plant within it. A lot of the times you see teams still try and have that more open plant. This could create quite an awkward scenario. In fact, they managed to spam Avova down. And because of that, it left the spike purely in the open. Still going to be left into a 3v3 scenario. No flanking coming. In fact, it, it, I almost wonder now if some of the defenders have started to wonder if they're going back in a different direction instead, though. No, they're going for the res. And the res almost serves as a bait, pulling the players into the open, allowing Batty G to take the kill before going down. Things are getting a little bit awkward here with Nuki stepping up. Meadow has to do the same. He's gone in for the kill, but the shots won't land. He's fallen back. Oh, the flash is so good from Zipan. It's going to come out with a couple, but then they go. They actually overswing it. Angel goes down to the pistol. The headhunter doing his job. Now, they still haven't managed to clear Xiao from this backline, and the rotation's already come through from Batty G to sort of stack things up a little bit. The other problem as well for G2 is the clock. Like, with these players still here, no rotation really available. They have to just try and fight into mix off. He's got his third kill of the round, though. This is just the pistol invested. A few hundred credits put into this round, and they've managed to do so much damage with it and even bring it into contention. Xiao... Trying to bait out that sound a little bit, and because of that, they don't expect him to be here, and that'll be enough to close.
Uh, luckily, still had a rifle. Just hiding behind the box. Hasn't really been spotted, but Xiao is going to check the corner. Up and above he goes, just clearing out every player in his way. Headshots galore, and I, I, I don't think a stinger works like that. I, I, like, I know he's only got one kill, but I, that was way too clear. Got a lot of pressure from G2 on this side. They were waiting for FDX to swing on in, and once that wall went down, exactly what happened. Oh! Sagetsu's found a free kill! They're right back into this one now. Viper's pits online. If Sagetsu can get control of the site, get that little bit closer. Already taken down and out of Swarm, and what a shot! Nukia completely oh beheaded, God. and Mixwell meets the same fate. Sagetsu's on a tear, and there's the Viper's pit going down. Meadow is going to be caught quickly by Xiao. Man, it's good to see Xiao getting the work done. Plant coming through for FPX and another kill as well. This is looking like a convincing pistol for the attackers. G2 are going to have to do a damn good job of retaking. Yeah, I, I, I don't even know if there is a way back into this. They're standing out in the open just as almost like a, a layered offensive this site. I don't even know if they're going to get a kill at this point. Nuke is trying to fight back and well, he'll get one. That is all FPX. Utterly dominant phone's ringing right now it's just like zeros getting added on every day it's uh just been so huge zip down right away though so we're gonna need a hero for fbx to step it up pistol in the hands of angel lots of disadvantages to play with and hoodie's only good for the one plants might at least be secured but they're looking to take batty g down right afterwards good punish by angel but they'll be dealt with as well and this is just really nicely played by g2 pretty much every engagement they go into teams I will say earlier on, back in back in beta, <laughs> seating matches were completely pointless, and you saw it oh. in the way teams were like knifing each other and stuff. <gasps> uh -oh. oh, that plant should have come down long, long ago. That is a big delay coming in from G2. They break the wall and they destroy them really nicely handled. Destroyed, and there's the ulti to cancel out any of the remaining utility. Very nicely handled. Now G2. They played far back, they've given the control, but now they can't use their utility and they are being rolled on. FPX steaming forward with metal <laughs> falling. It's left to Mixwell to 1v5 clutch this. Ground already diminished. Like that, That's the thing, Like Mixwell can only do so much, finding two kills, but basically at the value of one. And but you can see again, they're going to try and go for the same after plant. The spam is going through, but this time, Maddy G will get it down. And actually, it's Hoodie who falls instead. Lockdown coming into play. How much space is that really going to get G2 here, though? Nothing. He destroyed it. He, he, he destroyed it. He, he threw in the it fragment. Felt... You're talking about utility coming out of Zipad. It, it just obliterated it. This man is playing an incredible game with utility. Yeah. And I think, did he just kill the player through the corner of the wall? Now Zipan left, but it's all going to be on to Saigetsu. New K. Oh, he's not quite going to kill. Looks like they're going to try to blitz on out the cage on the right. They've been spotted out by Meadow. He'll get the snake bite down, but not quite in time. Zipan goes bolting through it to take the opening. The shot connected by Sagetsu makes this so difficult now. The spike can actually be planted if they get around, but there's the shot. Evolva connects it just in time, and he's going to be able to delay them a couple more seconds. That plant, though, it's going down by Zipan. They're not able to catch him. There's the shot. Three kills already under his belt. One more to find. It's so close. Mixwell down to one HP, and the shot will be found by Zipan. FBX get the first. They're coming down here to try and reinforce the A site hoodie. Ooh gonna hold on well with a nice shot connected Evova though has been spotted still the rest of his team are here to help and Hoodie just keeps on delivering tapping away with the Guardian in hand and leaving Sagetsu to do it all although Hoodie is low and maybe Sagetsu can get that kill it's Mixwell and Meadow that I'm worried about you know these guys are on full health they're up against a Bulldog as well so it's not even a world where if Sagetsu can hit the headshot and he wins. He's actually got to hit the headshot and then some more, you know, follow up that spray onto the body. And you're seeing here that ain't going to be too easy now that they know where he is. I've got a crossfire up. And yeah, there's Hoodie. That was the one shot kill. The rest of these are going to be tough with 40 seconds left. Even still, though, any extra damage he can do, it's not bad. Like, sure, they definitely did have a rifle other than this, but... It seems like Meadow's got an incredible read on this. Possible that someone at this point has managed to slip the net. Bit of an awkward fight. And whilst I get to, he at least gets one. 
Now the push coming to get back through, and Mixwell's looking to try and take some extra ground. He's going to walk into the majority of the opposition, but he gets away with it. And now even has support to try and hold on to that cross as well. He won't be able to escape the drone, but he will be able to escape the players. Yeah, that aggression might seem crazy, but he was waiting for this rotate oh, to come through from Nukia. On the way to the B site, Mixwell's running away, has to use his anchor to get out of there. Zipman, oh, he's going to go down. That slow is deadly. Yeah, this is already looking nigh on impossible. They need someone to make a mistake and Mixwell holding the angle with an operator. Oh, oh okay, the quick switch. We've seen that one before, but he even chimes in with a third. The quick switch, but as said, pace change. And that's the end of the game. Uh, looks to have worked to at least seize them this space, but they ran right into the operator flash over from Evova as he looks to deal with the players inside of Cave. And he does exactly that, man. A quick and clean double kill. Angel's on 30 HP after the initial attempt to entry Player through. Standing. He's gone. And this is looking just like the Eco. You know, G2. Make this one look clean. Make it look easy. Damn. A six on the board flawlessly needed. Yeah, I, I don't know how you come back into this with a double operator, especially now that you've just lost one of your rifle players. There's also a flank coming back through, which we'll get a lot of information in a second because they're starting to walk back in towards the trip and Saigetsu is going to catch Nuke before he can do anything else. Hoodie has managed to catch one. And again, if they can make this costly, it might cause a few awkward positions in this retake. And Mixwell finding another again. They're starting to drop some of these players. Saigetsu's spot, though, makes it impossible for them to escape. They've also left that fight. That's just it's so hard to read. You shouldn't expect it. I don't blame them at all. That's a free kill for Nukia. Uh, oh. What? Oh, he's on today. He is on today. That free kill ain't so free anymore. Nukia's even lit down on low HP on his way back. That flash a little late from Evolva. Now they know that he's actually up close. Or maybe they don't. Angel's walking around what? with no idea. Evolva. This man's an enigma. He must be invisible because he's just taking them down and no one's even firing back. There we go. So guess who's found him. Oh, oh my God. I, no, he can't go for anything more. So I get to this is ridiculous. He's going to find out where the last man is. It seems like he had the information oh. all along. What an ace from Saigetsu. Quite landing. Look at these players on site talk. They're so scared. They know they're about to be crunched on. And now Meadow spotted. He's only good for the one before he goes down. His teammate had already fallen behind him. That's a free plan for FPX. Oh, you're nasty. <laughs> If he's not winning the round, he's lurking back behind them. Nuke trying to find something with this blade storm, but why well, it's not looking too likely. Still has a rifle behind it, but a one versus three, and already a reposition from Saigetsu, just as the last man in case things do go wrong. They have a backup plan for it, and I don't know if they're even gonna need it. Nuke seemingly not even knowing where those remaining are exactly, yeah. <laughs> He's flipped the switch, has not he? Nice flash! Oh, that's fantastic. Angel had no idea what to do. And the follow-up is quick and clean. They moved to that site so quickly. Sagetsu can't even make it through the double doors. And he's already been spotted and taken down. Now, just don't give him a chance to pre-fire anything. If, if you just run at him, then he can't guess exactly where you are before you've even shown yourself. But ahead. hey, Xiao, one versus four, turn three. Chances slimmer than ever with the plant already down and I, I again you've got to try and isolate some of these fights almost hope that they peak a more hoodie and the enemy and i like it <laughs> it's the good plan for liquid didn't work though fbx getting pressured angel down already shouts here to help but he's now on 40 hp luckily he's got a friend as well so gets you right beside him recon actually might reveal one or two still inside the orb though so sadly not this time good damage Remaining. They ain't gonna last all too long. Five These trades coming in a. thick and fast. I gotta say, for G2's buy, they've done a remarkable job. And we mentioned Nukia having the marshal. Uh, Mixwell's just deadly with this pistol. The headhunter is doing exactly that again and again. Oh, Zipan. That's a big mistake. Left it wide open for Mixwell, the player who came in without a rifle, but it certainly didn't look that way. Well. <laughs> G2 wants to go to the A site, and they have to at this point still it's only pistols they're up against as long as they don't run into this unaware they should be <laughs> fine oh god how is this happening there's only two players left alive 
There's only 10 seconds left. They've got to start left. this plant soon on this attacking side, and they can. A bit comes down to Saigetsu. He's being completely surrounded. There are, it, it's such a tough position to try and hold on to. He has absolutely no support. Still manages to get one for his troubles. They've lost space, but Nuke in an incredibly audacious position turns it back into a 3v3. Oh, look at that utility. Just a moment too late. It caught Hoodie, and then the second Shock Dart caught him. The rest of the damage. Oh, oh Mixwell looked away at the wrong moment. And Meadow's been spotted. They know just where he is. At least the first will be found. Meadow in for another, but he oh. cannot get away out of ammo and out of luck. It right here for G2 after map one and everything like that. They pinched themselves. They've woken up. This is a big oh, push, though. smoke into two people and still gets a kill the man literally has no fear still though we've ended up in a four a 3v3 even situation and them trying to break back in That's unreasonable so oh my what? he almost got him Meadow's four hp and he's oh. gone down that might have even been a leg tiger i'm not sure volva has gone hoodies in the open another clutch attempt at 30 hp uh... <laughs> Angel, are you all right, bro? Sugetsu's got to clutch this one now, and he's lost oh it out. God. 12 to 8, and that's What's the worst on? way. In terms of geometry, I guess. Zipan going to try to take some of the utility out of their hands, and Meadow's going to follow up with a kill. It's at least a good start uh, from what was ultimately a... Oh, my God. I just noticed where that poison orb is, actually. It's a huge gap in it. They've panic thrown that in a little bit too late, I think. Oh, they're not going to check the box. They're going to check the box. So he gets, he gets one for free. Angel has found another. And now it's left all onto Mixo. I'm pretty sure Baddy oh. thought the round was already over and it's not. Mixo is going to take it home. What are these last few rounds? Oh my goodness. That makes no sense. Angel shocked up, but it's almost just a bait. Try and get them to move, but he's done a lot of damage to even the remaining couple of players as well. Information there, and the initial push has been shut down, and just look at this. It's a one-two punch. You got the paranoia waiting, but they're not even going to expect this crossfire to be there. Zipan, he actually just decides to swing. He was going to hide in the corner, but he's walled off the other side of that push. Just a disgusting setup. To see it, but no value to be found from that Odin, at least on the initial hold from Angel. This going to be a play towards the a site and there's the tag up the trap wire already finding its first victim with mixwell down uh -oh. but evolva snuck in trades come in g2's favor as they Fight claim control of the site now a plan can be found fbx have a couple of uh, surprises up their sleeve though you know angel's about to have his recon back online and that's where we can see this odin coming through for some value maybe Oh, Zipan actually manages to find that kill. Now, sure, you have the afterplant Hunter's Fury, but instead they're just going to try and wall him off. Are they going to make it really awkward so that he can't actually peek without completely swinging back around? <laughs> Zipan is such a ratty little player. Vision probably doesn't see things clearly through it. That's what the issue is. It's actually just all pixelated. And... Oh! <laughs> <laughs> see, he, he couldn't see him. That's why he gets the hit. 36 <laughs> HP left. The Odin spam's going to be tough now for Mixwell. Oh, he's no. going to have to deliver with it. Oh, he's down already. The drop coming into play. Meadow no. didn't even hear Zipan coming down behind. And Nukia will try his best to get in here. Shock he's got to stop the defuse. Shocks are through. One. There's the second. It's not going to get it done. The heal underway. And they can't get the defuse. Oh. Not in time. Clutch. He's run down the clock just enough to get the clutch. G2. There's a tag, Meadow and Mixwell both hit and Meadow will be finished off. A big blow dealt by Angel and he's not even on the uh, side. What's Patty doing? He's in the open, caught unaware and now they've seen Sagetsu as well. Oh, they've recovered that one. Oh, Ooh. have they? Evolve has something to say about it and this guy's been remarkable so far. Yeah, there, there, there's always an Evolve catch somewhere in a series. It normally comes with a, a ninja defuse, but unfortunately, <laughs> He's not on the right side, so he gets to us his neural theft, though. So all his sneaky play, his plans of confusion have gone completely out the window. Still has a couple of shadow steps, so might be able to try and fake him out a little bit. But realistically, going to walk straight through. And because there's someone within the smoke, they know that he's going in the other direction, or at least has the idea. There's always a cam! The man always has a cam <laughs> somewhere to catch you out. So Vova, just every single piece of information, oh. but he's landing the shots. That was down.
and then sitting in the cam until they walk out, not giving them the sound cues. Revealing area. That's a good recon. Good information. Like Angel left. should be quite cautious here because he knows he's up against the pistols. <laughs> uh, he's got teammates to back him up. Very nicely handled. Through. Seconds left. Oh, oh, Angel! <laughs> Oh my god! He lit hoodie to 10 HP through a wall. Now he's taking down Meadow. There goes Nukia. This round is starting to fall apart a little bit. At least a good step up by Hoodie, but with his low HP. We gotta look to some of his teammates to maybe make this happen. Xiao's even back online. And they have plenty of time still. Not feeling rushed whatsoever. Xiao maybe was. Gone diving in. Spotted one at least. The jump through the smoke reveals makes well up close, but the kill's coming quickly and in favor of G2. What? It's a Vova again to step it up. Burst through on the other side. Mixwell's waiting for it. He wants to catch them off, but they give him the space to punish. They expect that someone's maybe waiting on the other side. A great read. And now the follow-up can be there. Nano Swarm to buy a little bit of extra time, but the clock is not that big of an opponent right now. They just need to take these players out of the positions, the same positions that they destroyed this retake from before. Look at Hoodie and Meadow, and then they've got a Vova way, way back to provide that extra cover. Now time starts to be a little bit of a problem, but with Hoodie left alone, it is not. That was quick as could be a lightning fast retake. In finale. <laughs> it's the worst. Oh, oh, God, that's not a pretty fight. Tracer's being shown and everything. Easy as can be. And three versus five. Now, Tom, this round, you know, it wasn't the best for G2. They came in with pistols. They came in with uh, practically nothing or a few upgrades. And now they're walking out for now with a 3v2. An operator on the retake for Shao. Well, it's perfect for that fight, I guess. This is starting to get a little bit scary, to be honest. I thought G2 had this one locked in. No, no, no don't you do it. I love the optimism. And no doubt, someone that has a lot to prove. Okay, this is an aggressive stance, and it's worked perfectly. Great control oh. coming out of G2. Although FBX, they're able to fight back a little bit. Angel even Got catching them off guard on that mid play. Zip unable to use that to his advantage. And the chaos, well, it breeds a favorable advantage for FBX. Evova, though, he's been spotted. But he's seen Angel. Great shot down to just a sliver of health. Angel will be dealt with as the wall of the door closes and zip on plants. That's info for Evova. He is a Vova. There's the steps. <gasps> zip on heard the steps. He knows exactly where he is. He's going to do a nasty wall. I thought he was going on top of it, Tom. <laughs> I think for a second, maybe he did as well. <laughs> In fact, you can see Evova just like, where is he? I don't believe it could be this obvious. Oh, I thought for a second he might have a, a shadow step to get on top of that one, but instead he's just going to have to try and break it and give himself an angle. I, I like the fact that he's put the dark cover down just to give him a little bit of extra space, but <laughs> he shoots it for his teammate. So they have no idea if this spot is clear. Oh, they're going to drone it. Yeah, they're going to see it. And there you go. Forced out into the open, forced into combat. Very nicely handled round. But it's looking like it will indeed be flawless. This is the first man you're going to deal with. He's caught with oh, his smoke no. out. That timing. Now they smoke the cross. Get over towards the side. And look at this. Meadow doesn't know where to play from. Where to, There's nowhere to hide. Even gets revealed. Oh, God. It's close, but it's not quite a kill. And now this retake becomes more and more difficult. No command is available, but realistically, they're going to want to try and find a kill to get them back in. And while well, Hoodie has got one, turns into a 1v2 scenario. And... I gets you just no risk by the drone so he can't even use that one way hoodie gonna be isolated within this site needs some support needs to get something done as he's pressured oh, nice he's couple of down. shots though lines them up but still his teammates fall around him leaving a stinger on the edge of this smoke not ideal the timing could work out but around the corner they go still a trade back in their favor the cross to the site just about working out but they have to go for this plant and i wonder a g2 gonna try and pressure this Oh, actually, FPX are pressuring it. Xiao goes up top, takes one down. There's the op for Mixwell, though. Glass cannon, it may be. Meadow's there to close it out, so it doesn't even matter. For Avova as well, they have an awful lot of delaying utility, but still, Zipan's just walked in and got the opener, and then the dash through is almost just a distraction, allowing Angel for the second. I, that, that execution, I feel like, should have gone far worse. 
they've only seen Saigetsu. That was the thing. He, he made sure he was the one to fight the drone, so they can't really risk the rotation. They do have the From the Shadows, but Xiao is already through. Now, the lockdown might make things a little bit more awkward. In fact, they're going to have to break it, which they will use the ultimate just for that. And they're able to try and clear out this site. Xiao is just on a tear. His fourth kill already in the round, and he's going to ace it to close out map number two. For a little bit, but they're giving up a completely. I mean, there's no way that G2 can maintain control of this. Not when you've got a Vova sitting over there behind the smoke. He gets, like, as soon as he smoked off, you're running this clock way down. Unless Hoodie's thinking of something a little different, but he's only clearing the catwalk. It's okay. This is the battle. Something we'll see quite regularly. I imagine Xiao doing incredible work just to bring this back into a 4v4 scenario. And Angel even going to peek with him still, though. Hoodie actually gets away with it, managing to put the advantage back in their favor. And while well, Nuke finding the man at the back of the site, it makes things impossible. They're surrounded completely. Solid retake coming up. Well, they have information that there's players around these angles. Of course, Mixwell has that quick escape mechanic and down, oh, this crossfire in mid is just filth he will eventually just leave the remaining players to try and battle and well i'd be surprised if there's any sort of kill here back make sure that if there was any counter so that, that is massive for mixor and a huge boost for them going into this round again an incredibly fast pace taken to mid i have noted that so far it has not uh, been Angel taking the control into ropes, which I will say I'm quite thankful for. Still though, New King actually gets out and because of that kill as mentioned, he has the showstopper, almost manages to close out another as well. And he's got teammates to trade him back. Angel still survived quite a bit now as they look to move to the site. They've smoked off spawn already. Angel gonna be playing on the edge of that flash in hand, ready to pop, but he's mollied out and taken down. Sagetsu still putting up a good fight. Here comes the swing, but Mixwell a little bit too fast. He gets there just in time. I think that defuse is theirs. Ooh. Uh, for me, it's always been like, you've got to make the pay for that mid control. With 35 seconds left, here comes the crunch. G2 have more players than expected here. Hoodie up top is a prime example of that. Now, Vova looking to step up even more. And this man just keeps on delivering. Yeah, this is, oh my God, what a shot. It's not enough though. He's still alive and Hoodie's now stepped in. Although he's tagged up, it's not going to take him down, but that what? is Wait, Angel has caught him down on. below. Zipan's back online. That's a big res. Nuke, you're falling. G2, they've looked dominant so far, but FBX, they finally cracked the code. They figured it out here, and well, now this should be the first round of the board for the attacking Spike side. Planted. Got full faith in that. No way they come back into this. That's another shot uh, for Mixwell. This is getting a little bit scary, okay. but... Luckily, they've dealt with Meadow, and so is Chance as well. They From the shadows to get into the back of sight after they've used this ultimate. Now, of course, there's the easy escape, but actually, Meadow, he sticks around, and now he's got one of his own. He can delay the push completely. The whole point was that they needed to isolate one of the players. So I get to, he's gone in a lot of space and comes out with two. Information given over, and well, you've teleported to the other side of the map. Mixwell, not in a bad position. He's read this well, and it's... Oh! Now giving them a chance back into a 2v2 scenario. And both players stuck towards the back of that site. Now, there is a molly to clear things, but Mixwell doesn't need it. He's trying to do this all alone. Still got off over alongside him and through, but there needs to be a trade and it will be there. Incredible round from Mixwell. Flash is so good though, and they even have the aftershock to clear it out. The man advantage lasts a matter of seconds and now, well, they're one behind. Yeah, it's a tough one. Moving back in towards the B site will be easy, though, because the rotates come through. G2 are gone. They're out of here. Obviously, you had Hoodie rotating to pop the heal, but no one stayed behind to maintain control. So they're a little bit cautious as they move up through heaven, as they clear out these angles, even moving in towards screens with the same sort of caution. Oh, that timing. If of all the swarm. <gasps> oh, he hit Zipan. <laughs> it's a little bit of revenge, I guess. The second player gets connected. And that actually gives him the ability to sort of shut down an initial plant. They don't expect Shout to still be here. And he makes this one look possible. Saigetsu in a one versus two. Meadow's still on the corner. New case been spotted, but he peeks. And this man is so good at just predicting those. <laughs> now, this is, uh, this could very well still be a 10-2 half. Uh oh, oh. <laughs> 
Okay, I guess that's the new use for the stim. Yeah. Just there. if you're being wrecked Find by utility, plenty. just use it to escape. Nice shot from Zipan again. He's opened up the last couple of rounds. Seems like he's come online to at least give them some opportunities here. Zipan is slaughtering. And just two remain. Last player oh, nice oh. attempt. But I need this pistol to, to even out the odds a little bit. Right? Put G2 back on the back foot. Make sure that momentum doesn't build up on the attack. This is still going to be a split through mid, but look at the rotate through. Angel's ready with a flash. He doesn't even get a chance to use it. It doesn't matter. The Xiao and Zipan are too quick on the kills. And this 2v5 now, uh, it should be impossible. Yeah, especially without any mistakes. It needs some sort of miracle. And it, it, it seems like the, the information is just there at the moment for FPX. Will be Angel to close things out. And, you know, Mitch, I got a question for you. Do, do you know how many rounds... Uh... Figuring out the maximum of that mechanic. Up right there, but uh, <laughs> they got the trade. Uh, yes, it was calculated. Hmm. <laughs> uh, I sometimes I genuinely believe the cast of curse is real. Like <laughs> everything in my brain tells me it's not, and then you see something like that, and you go, maybe this round's a lot closer than it should have been. So in fact, for a second, it was looking winnable, but Baddy G has put them in the dark. Four kills. <laughs> yeah, credits wise, nothing, but uh, value. They've taken him down. They've taken down the big threat. Uh, Nuki is walking in. Here we go. Nade in towards the spawn. Oh, I saw that headshot. 30 seconds left. I saw it. It was a headshot, but through the box, not quite enough. Nuki is still alive. Jesus. His fourth kill of the round now secured. This man is on for a, a quiet ace. It's not a clutch. It's not a big play. He's just walking around, taking some fights, having a party or a, well, a bucky as we see for show. my god oh fair play they checked oh there we he go. still got it that's a gamble it's not paid off g2 are rolling the dice here and finding nothing for it now they run through blind a rolling thunder comes in what and that's happening? gonna ruin their day oh man they have just been destroyed evolva's gonna try his best to pull it back great kill to start it off but a 1v4 still remains and it's way too much to ask the player to go out of the site, but here's the problem as Zipan leaves, Sagetsu's still here, and they haven't dealt with him. He's good for the first uh caught by hoodie. Well handled, now they can plant. Oh, just about. Still, Mixo's gonna be dropped. He, he was sort of the only man with any extra space other than the site, and in fact, they've realized that and opt to try and fight out from it. A chance for Angel, but he'll get nothing, and now the swing comes back. Oh! It's a lineup for Angel. All onto a Vova. 19 HP and Xiao is just waiting, making sure he's not giving away a headshot angle. And the problem is the time he can even give that heal over of over. Looking like he's going to try and fight for this. Might be a surprise with the timing. It's just a little bit off. Left. They're now waiting for him to go for that plant, waiting for him to have to try and stick this. And in fact, they even have themselves a res as bait. Here we go again. Same attempt. Quick pace. Boosh, 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 boosh. And Xiao comes out on top, at least initially. Angel oh! fighting back! Two kills in quick succession. The one way works out for a moment, but they do manage to bypass it. Still, though, they've got to get past Zipa. Well, that was easy. First step done. Hoodie! What? It's just going ham! Three kills now for him, and it leaves Saigetsu. A clutch situation. He does not know that the other player is still just waiting behind. He's tried to fake the drop, and he's made it. All the way onto Hoodie's position, but this man! It's Angel's ult. It's Angel's op, though. This is what I'm staring at. We've already seen the damage he can have, and there's the opening already found. Rolling Thunder right after 20 seconds left. He's running down the clock for his teammates to rotate in. There's person. the shot. <laughs> Spike down. 15 seconds up top. Whoa. Hello, Angel. Not going to land it, but he stays alive and keeps taking heads. Great flash. The Mixwell might take him down, but he hasn't got enough to prevent OT. Breaks on that play while Zipan tries to work behind. They're checking it. They're holding it, but they've turned back. The timing is perfect. The window is there. First for Zipan, but he won't get any more. The rest of the team needs to push out. Oh. Needs to trade him out. And that TP brings Mixwell up top where he's One able to grapple. This is Last looking good for G2. But Xiao, well, he might just be the savior for FPX needed. Baited. 
trying to pull in of over, but he's not falling for it. In fact, he's got it almost spot on. It's going to have to be the reaction shot from Xiao, but he now spots his opponent, and the swing is there! He's going to get himself the... Still going to run into quite a number of players, though. They hope more have rotated out still. The fights start well with the opening in their favor. Xiao going to try to stay alive. Wrapping around and round the site, but eventually Nukia takes him down. There's the trade, but brought back into their favor convincingly. G2 have got this round in the bag. And they close it out to bring us to another OT. Doesn't get a lot of kills. They're going to have a tough round. They haven't cleared him. <laughs> That's big. It's going to be a couple coming back with Baddie G, taking that control on towards the side. You've got Meadow. He's actually going to stun through, and he gets one of them. Doesn't need to go for anything more. Doesn't need to take that risk. And although Xiao is likely to guarantee them the plant, it's more interesting what Angel's going to be doing. Slowly taking back that space into heaven. He needs a big play here, and he's slowly getting surrounded in. The worry is actually that flank coming through from Hoodie instead, and he's going to have to isolate one of these jewels quickly. First goes his way, but he's not expecting the second, and now Xiao is left alone again, knowing he can't just sit back, knowing he can't just hold on to the site. He tries to find something, and will get absolutely nothing. Solid retake coming out from G2. Three seconds left. Problem starting to mount. He's got to show up. Xiao's at least covering from afar. I don't know that they spotted him. No, they didn't. That's a big kill. But Chow still needs to be dealt with in towards the back of the site. Good connection, but through the wall, Zipan will finish him off. 10 seconds left, but they've got the plan. They've got the space to do so. Nice nade. It's going to force him towards the elbow. They've caught one on the crossover. Not seeing Hoodie just yet. And Zipan deals with him. They know exactly where Meadow is. And they'll hold My on a little God. bit longer. FBX aren't letting this one go, Tom. I wasn't kidding. We're going OT after OT. Let's keep it rolling. Last time... I remember, like I said, not the 05. Coming on into round number 29. Another OT for us to play on out. Attack side for FBX. Zip and well, he is really attacking. Uh -oh. That's Angel gone to the <laughs> nade. And this is starting to get a little bit spooky. I have the spy. Addy G getting up behind. Oh. Might be, though. Oh, he's not being checked and even sees Nukia. Heaven control is theirs. The walkout gets him spotted oh, up. Mixwell gorgeous. dealt with instantly. Meadow. Has it all to do? A 1v3 planted open for heaven, and the first player proves to be too much. FPX have done it again. I'm gonna hold my breath, oh, Angel! There's been a couple of times today he's been caught out on a bit of a Spike odd down, position. Please. That one was for free. Trades back and forth. Zipan as the oh. last line of defense, but maybe that's all the defense they need. He's got the push through as well, and Zipan is doing it all on his own. An escape needed from Avova, and he'll dodge the showstopper. He'll make it back. Actually has the spike as well. So out of all the scenarios, there is a possibility. Now the wall again is down on that A side of the map, but it will start to break. And well, you bet your life he's going to shoot through it if there's still time left. Yeah, it should be perfect right as he gets here. Starting to break up. And there you go. Just a few bullets needed on the way to the A side. I'll be one away from ulti as well, so you can even start to kind of skirmish, look out for those. I think FPX, they, they're they stuck together with glue at this point. You know, they do not want to go down in one kill and give him that orbital strike. Smoke down, he's been spotted. Evolva stuck in the elbow, blast pack through, and there's the peak from Z. 